The history books are full of incredible men and women who have accomplished phenomenal things. And as we look at their lives, there are a few things that they always have in common. Courage, we already talked about. Another is perseverance. One of the great stories of perseverance that's had an incredible impact on my life is the story of Abraham Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln was born into poverty. In 1816, while he was just a child, his family was forced out of their home. And as a child, he had to go to work and help support them. In 1818, his mother died. In 1831, he failed in business. In 1832, he decided he wanted to run for the Illinois House of Representatives, but he lost. That same year, 1832, he lost his job. That same year again, he decided he wanted to go to law school, but his application was rejected. In 1833, Abraham Lincoln borrowed some money from a friend to begin another business. By the end of the year, the business had failed and Lincoln spent the next 17 years of his life paying off that debt. In 1834, he ran for the state legislator again and lost. In 1835, he was engaged to be married, but his fiance died and broke his heart. In 1836, Abraham Lincoln suffered a total nervous breakdown and spent more than six months in bed. In 1838, Abraham Lincoln sought to become speaker of the state legislator and was defeated. In 1840, he sought to become elector and was defeated. In 1843, he ran for Congress and lost. In 1846, he ran for Congress again. This time he won and he made his way to Washington. But in 1848, he sought re-election in Congress and again lost. In 1849, he sought the job of land officer in his home state and was rejected. In 1854, he ran for the U.S. Senate and lost. In 1856, he sought the vice presidential nomination at his party's national convention. He got less than 100 votes and lost. In 1858, he ran for the U.S. Senate again and lost. And then in 1860, he decided to run for president. I mean, based on what? He won. He won and he went on to become one of the greatest presidents in U.S. history. Throughout your life, you're gonna come up against tons of obstacles. You're gonna face obstacles in your career. You're gonna face obstacles in your faith life. You're gonna come up against obstacles in your health and well-being, in your personal finances, in your relationships. Life, there's tons of obstacles in life, but when you come up against those obstacles, remember this, persevere, press on. You see, the people who persevere, they never regret having persevered. It's the people who give up, it's the people who quit. Their lives get filled with regrets. Don't be one of those people. Press on, persevere. Allow God's grace to fill your life. Persevere in your prayer. Take those few minutes each day to reconnect with yourself, reconnect with your God, so you can get really clear about who you are and what you're here for and what matters most and what matters least, so that you can live a meaningful life. You're gonna come up against tons of decision points in your life. When you come to those decision points, persevere in doing the next right thing. You'll never be sorry that you did. God bless you. I'm praying for you. Persevere.